Okay. Let us return. I'm pretty sure that nobody's upset about our parking job. We made sure to keep out of everybody's way. Yeah. You know what I keep forgetting as well? There's all these little bits of food on the way back we should be picking up. Some mollusks. Nice, tasty, delicious mollusks. Ew. Gross. A glowing blue dot is a large trophy fish, dubbed the boss fish, which gives superior material gain for catching. Oh, that's right. I remember there are actually some legendary fish you can catch. I remember that now. Yeah. Oh, ow! Watch the enemy's movements. Don't. Yep. Right. Got it. Healthy creature spitting all over me like that. This sounds like you're having fun. That's so cool. So very cool. I love that they do little things like that. Let's have a look. Yeah, I mean, this guy's only been sat. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> so there's two cars waiting in the tunnel, and there's one guy here, like, come on, move. They've been sat there all night. Here we go. Seatbelts, everyone. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, three cars in the tunnel. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Didn't mean to. Ah. We're good. Temptation to jump. <laughs> Just to give it a booster, you know, and over the fence. Everybody out. <sighs> All right. What do we have up here? You know what we haven't done in a while? Save the game. Since, like, the start of the playthrough today. <sighs> Yeah. This storm's gonna ruin my hair. I'm not sure whether it's a storm front or just the terrain. Yeah, just worry about your stuff blowing away. Oh, Talcott now has a quest. So he was the quest giver. You doing, Talcott? Good, Prince Noctis. <laughs> What's that there? Oh, this thing? It's a cactuar figurine. I really like cactuars. Oh. You can buy them in different places. Oh, we They're got one of those colors. as well. I want to finish the collection, but I still need a yellow one and a blue one. I guess. I believe have I have one shops. of those. Have you? Oh, sorry, no. Liar. I paid attention to them before. I did. Well, of course you wouldn't. But I will from now on. If I see the colors you're missing, I'll grab them for you. <gasps> hey, name unspoken. Uh, look at the positive side. If you died before saving, at least you know what you need to get, uh, uh, to get done. Yes, that's true. Um, it's not so much the death that I'm really? worried about the saves for. Thank you. It's the fact that this game is, was, for a while, when we first got started with the playthrough, crashing to desktop constantly. Yeah, we had a lot of problems with it. So now I keep wanting to save like an obsessive 
creature, you know. <laughs> and it only did that whenever I was streaming. I could play it on its own, no problem, but at one point it was just getting worse and worse. And then, through no apparent reason, I'm not pretty sure I didn't change anything specific, it stopped doing it. Fingers crossed. Knock on wood, as it were. And it's fine now. And has been for a week and a half. Again, knock on all the wood. Stop talking, Matt. You're going to jinx it. Excellent catch, Prince Noctis. I'll start cooking straight away. So, yeah. Thanks for the help. I had to turn all the graphic settings it's all the way down all. because it runs like shit cats. when it's being encoded into a stream. City. Wow. That's a lot of cats. So, yeah. Yes, I Such is life. Fond memories with them. Making this food reminds me of the time we spent together. Sorry to keep you waiting. I hope your furry friend finds this to his liking. You better bloody do. I had to literally slave over a fishing rod for like 10 minutes to catch this thing. Now, I'm pretty sure I got some cactile figures for this kid. Let's have a look. Items. Hang on. Check. Um, there's my hairy horn. I've got... Guys, I have two hairy horns. Oh no, that's just a normal hairy horn. I have two giant hairy horns now. Mm-hmm. Oh yes. Um, it should come under treasure or key items. I know I bought a cactile figurine. I remember doing this. <laughs> Why would you keep talking about that wolf? Why would you tempt fate like that? I know. I know, I'm sorry, Shy. I'm sorry. Can't help myself sometimes. We have luxury cat food, enticing truffles, strange engines, Monica's cat food. Huh. What is Dom and Plum Pits? Seed that changes the colour of the chocobo's plume as you give him the feathers. Oh, they, okay, those are just some of the colours for the chocobos. Um, well, I mean, if yeah, I guess we don't have any of the cacti figures. I remember buying one. I know I did. Sorry, kid. Gladio, please just be gone. Thank you. It would be nice if we could find some way to track down the cactuars for him. I gotta say, though, it's a pretty grown up hobby for a little guy. Perhaps. Yes, collecting little figurines is a grown up hobby. Sounds like a plan. Let's do it. You're right there above the mark of the um, Bulgarian or whatever. Oh, there was one? Sorry again, hang on. Above the mark of the Fulgarian. That was in the key items, was Mark of the Fulgarian. It's the Archean. Cactar statue. I knew I did. Figurine modeled after a famous floral creature, the subtle curves, blah 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 blah. Maybe it's just the wrong type. Maybe it's the wrong type. I don't know. All right, dinner is served. <laughs> You're really eating it up. Cat is spoiled rotten. I thank the chef. <laughs> really got a soft spot for animals, don't you? Well, they bring out a nicer noct. Could try being nicer to us. Could, but I won't. Yeah, right. I got a sky gemstone for that. Don't we need that for one of the other upgrades on the other machinery? Ah, oh, y'all brace yourself for power. Apparently not. Hmm. All right. So now that we've done that, uh, 
Which is beyond measure we can do another day. Um, I want to get the last Imperial base. Turn that in. And then when we do, we'll pick up the hunt for the Griffin. See what that quest is. By which time we'll probably be, uh, he'll probably be done. Oh, living off the land, we've got to do this thing as well where we plant some seeds, but we'll do that another day. Oh, hey, look, the map tells us where we need to go. Interesting. Okay, well, we know where we're going to go and get those then. Right. And then, I think, we're going to go to Altitia, if there's time. We'll finally press on with some actual story. But that's going to throw us into the linear part of the game. But then when we get to a certain point in the story, we can then come back here. And finish off any of the side quests before going to the final fights. <laughs> There's actual story in this game? I know! What? <laughs> it's like Skyrim, you know, it's like, yeah, there's a story over here, it's like, you know, you know, Nord for the Nordlings, and, you know, that kind of thing, and down with the Empire, and then, you know, that kind of stuff, but I ain't got time for that, there's another dragon orbiting over there around that hill, I'm gonna go kill it, get its bones, and use them to craft more dragon armor, I'll be back. I know, I'll get to the story later, but oh look, I can build houses as well, and I could join, um, you know, the Assassin's Guild and the Thieves Guild and everything. I'm, yeah, story. Uh, who needs that? Ready to leave the road Hang on, what am I doing? I wanted to fast travel. It's a long way. Errand run the game, exactly. But they're fun. They're good games. I like that kind of stuff. Yeah, we need to cross pretty much the whole goddamn map. Uh, we're gonna have to fast travel to there. <laughs> oh look, another bucket to steal! Yes! And another broom to add to the collection. Don't forget the brooms. Gotta get all the brooms. One of these days those brooms are gonna be useful. You're gonna come up short if you don't take them, so loot all the brooms. I'll scrolls the birth of my kleptomania. Mm hmm Yeah. Best thing to do is to use the grab tool to just pick, like, buckets up and put them on the tops of guards' heads. It's like... Loop. They just stand there like, you know, well, met kinsman. Should be a no nice lolly gagging and all that stuff. And you're like, yeah, never mind the bucket on your head. <laughs> you could do that to steal stuff in shops. Like, the shopkeepers wouldn't come after you. If you, uh, I don't know, did they patch that out though? I think they patched that out. But you used to be able to go into the, like one of the shops, pick up a bucket, put it over the character's head and it blocked his line of sight, which is what detection was based upon. They did patch it? Ah, that sucks. Yeah, because then you would block their line of sight and then you could just steal everything off the display and walk out and they were just like, you know, let me know if you want to do any trade, and you're like, yeah, I will do. <laughs> yeah. Shall we camp here? <laughs> it was so fun. This is the stupidest idea, but I loved it. Okay. Photo time. We'll get this turned in. We'll see if we can find the cacti figure at old uh, New Lestalem. See what that quest is. Pick up the griffin hunt. That's it. And then we'll go to Altitia. Oh, blessed weather. Yeah. Man. Getting a vibe now. I want to play Skyrim. We spent three and a half months in Fallout 4 though, didn't we? Do you guys remember that? I remember that. Man. So many games coming out. <laughs> uh, Skyrim, though. Nope, I have no recollection of that. Yeah, me neither. I mean, the VODs have gone now. It never existed. 
Didn't happen. Fake news. Must be dreaming. Magitech engine. Although there are some helpful highlights on the video section. Let's pick up whatever this is. Is these are these potatoes? I can't remember. Damn, this wind's strong. No, Peppers. I know it began with P. Think you got it bad? Check out Ignis. Whoa! You're right. It's rude to stare. Oh, those guys are gonna drop in. Oh, damn. They're dropping in right where we wanna be. Why didn't I bring the car up here, by the way? I keep forgetting now we're off-road. Bethesda the game company known for having only five voices in each game. Yep. We made a pun about that on Saturday when we got back to the um, the reactor quest over here in uh, Alt -Lat -Lat Stalin. Oh, shit. And uh, we met Gladio again. Like, we got back in touch with him, but he had the suit on, so you couldn't tell it was him. <laughs> Everyone was like, wait, is that Gladio? And I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> I knew, but I, yeah. And somebody, I think it was Alchemist, actually said, so is this like a Bethesda game where they only have, like, three or four voice actors? Yeah, pretty much. But yeah, they really do, don't they? Oh, you fall down, you lost two missile launchers, and you dead. Oh. <laughs> and there we go. Ow! Ow, ow, ow! Oh! No, 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 no. Rude. Oh go! Hey! 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 Wouldn't expect any less from you. Good. Going for it! Uh-huh! Hell yeah! Gladio, do it! Here we go! Boom! Over here! Yeah, Gladio, that's not happening. We're done. We're done now, Gladio. You can put the sword down. There we go. Okay, picture from here, I guess? Was well, not you? Hmm, who was it then? Take a shot from here. Somebody said that anyway, I don't remember who now. <laughs> oh, and predictably, more of them show up. Is it Loki again? Like, aha, you oh, thought I was dead. Shot. Like, God damn it, Loki, go away already. I think I can handle this. In we go! Oh god, out we go! Gotcha. I'm kidding. Oh! No big deal. No mercy! Whose side is you Didn't mean to do that. Those things are creepy. Yep. Alright. Prompto. Take a picture. And be prompt about it. Let's head back. Hmm? Who said that? Not me. Wait a minute, hang on a minute, hang on, hang on, hang on. Just a cotton picking minute. I still have wait, I have my engine blade three already. I just realized I never swapped out my sword after I gave him the engine blade three and he just he gave us them back. He got the auto crossbow still. Did it actually get upgraded? I guess it did. I want to see the circular saw in action. Let's do that. Oh. I haven't actually seen that yet. Interesting. I was waiting for Sid to call us back. It just struck me like, hang on, Sid never called us back to say that the... Um, uh, the other weapons were ready. So he usually takes them off you for a bit and then you're supposed to wait and he'll tell you when they're ready for picking up. But somehow we we still have them and they've all been upgraded. Mm, does not compute. Ah, 
I wonder why my throat was so dry. Got a full glass of water, but it's been sitting here for like three hours. Yep. Based coin. So I really cannot remember if there's an opportunity to leave Altisha and come back here at some point, but I wanna do what I did last time. I wanna make two saves. So that if things do go wrong, we can come back here and just carry on. Um parking spot. No. Just a map point. It's easier. Scrolling through the mega list of parking spots. No thanks. Be risky, do one save. Yeah. I just don't want to lose any options, you know? I want to see everything. I don't think this was one of those games, though, where it's like, if you progress a certain part of the way into the story, forget any side quests you didn't do, you can't do them anymore, because we've had games like that, where it's like, if you do this, you will never be able to do that. Fallout 4 was actually one of those, you know, several quests where I'm like, I can't no, wait to go do that either. quest. Did something else, and it was like, you can no longer do this quest, because what you just did fucked up something else over here, and now you can't do that quest. Huh. So, I, I like to not lose out. But I don't think this was one of those games. I do. I don't want to say why. I know why. You know, uh, you, you don't lose certain options. But I don't want to spoil it for other people. There is a reason why later on, when you come back, you can still kind of do things. Like which one in Fallout Four? I don't remember specifically. Um, it's like, it's the kind of quest where you get a faction, like, I suppose you could say the main quest line, whichever of the major factions you choose, you, if you don't do all the side quest content for one of the other factions, up to the point where you have to then choose a side, you won't be able to do them anymore, like if you, cho like we chose to do the Institute, if you do the Institute stuff, and then you get a few Brotherhood of Steel side quests, and you're like, oh, I'm gonna go do those, they look interesting, once you go past the point of no return on the Institute side, it's like, yeah, the Brotherhood hate you now, they're your enemy, and you can't do their side quests anymore. Oh. So it's, it's stuff like that, you know, which, which I don't like to restrict myself. I like to see all the content that I can up to a point. Uh, which vendor? Is it this guy that sells the uh, choco uh, chocobos? Let me know. Um, cactar models. Here we go. So he does have a cactar model. I remember buying it from this guy, though. Enjoy. So we got one. Back again. Sweet. That's the whole collection. Let's pay Telka to visit, shall we? But I understand that in Fallout 4. Yeah. That I'm looking forward to seeing. Indeed. It hasn't been easy for him. Let's go put a smile on his face. Oh, we're gonna go and put a smile on a kid's face. We've got him a cactus statue. <laughs> that's why the companies do that, so you have to replay it to, to get all the options. Yeah. That's the main reason. I mean, I don't mind that as well, to be honest. If there's replayability to see all the different stuff, that's fine by me. But you get more value out of a game that way as well. Okay, so what is this quest over here that we keep forgetting to collect? What do you want? Is it evening? Hey! It's hey! Evening how's it going? Hunter. Oh, me? Who else? <laughs> the name's Holly, by the way. Forgot to tell you earlier. Thanks for taking care of those demons. I tell you, that was a real shock, having them show up at the plant. I was so shocked, as a matter of fact, I went and did my back in. You're back? You're yep. gonna ask me to do it's your job for you now, aren't you? Grief. I can barely shuffle ten feet. But wouldn't you know it, the girl in charge of the valves is off today. Huh. Her job is to go through town and check they're all shut down. Oh, oh this one. You. What, you? Uh, I don't know. Sure, why not? If it's no trouble, that is. I remember struggling to find all the valves. Like, one of them, there's eight of them, and it's like, where the fuck is this last valve? <laughs> so, 
The women here have it rough. Yeah, everyone's got their hands full. They're in charge of the inspections and everything. Let's have a look. Maybe it marks them on the map now. No, they're just like, go here and search this area. Indeed. They know their way around the machinery like no other. Or I think it was like, I don't remember what the valves look like, and it's actually, I think it's these. Yes, it's these. Because unless you get right close to them, you don't get the option to interact with them. So, you know, Prince Noctis, never done any manual labor in his life, knows how to operate steam valves for a power plant. Sure. I bet he does. You've got to look for the ones that are steaming. This one. I mean, he's not going to blow this the whole town sky face. high by quick. messing with the pressure settings. Well, all in a day's work. Mm-hmm. Here we go. Here's several of them. This one's seen better days. Suppose I've got an easier time of it now since I have played this game before. I do kind of know what I'm looking for. This one needs a fix and quick. See, Prompto would be better at this. This is his shit. He knows this stuff. He probably even knows the part numbers for all these components on these valves because he's just that big of a nerd. Oh, we need to turn this in as well. Stinger quest. This, right? That's the stuff. Thanks. I almost forgot about that. So a store that has nothing I want will now give me even lower prices. Yeah. Saw a Magitek trooper the other day. Oh, I think he's done. That's the last one. Sweet. Actually, we should probably check his inventory. Maybe now he's put some good stuff in there that we can hey, use. What are you after this time? I know the part numbers for all the components on the valve. <laughs> you do? Oh. I might buy this game once it gets to around 20 USD. Yeah, I, mean, I got this, it was on the Steam sale recently, and I got this for about that kind of price. So, with all the, uh, the DLC content. Next time it comes around on the main sales again, like the uh, maybe the Halloween sale. I don't know, they sometimes put the theme of the game, so maybe not. Uh, winter sale though, a Black Friday sale. Keep your eye out for it, you know? And, uh, you know, by way of plugging, we're a Green Man Gaming affiliate. So, in case you haven't checked those guys out, they do their own sales. If you follow that link, that'll take you to our affiliate link. So, if you do see it on sale there, um, and it might not be on sale on Steam, you'll still get a Steam code. And you can also help this channel out by using that link. So, feel free to have a look there as well every now and then. Uh, follow the game, see if it, you know, pops up on the sales. Uh, right, so what has this guy got? He hasn't got anything really worth buying. He never increases his inventory. I'm sure I remember this guy adding more stuff the more um, of these quests you did. I'm pretty sure he used to do. But it doesn't seem to be now. Chinese. A broken harmonica. What is that? Caution! High pressure pipeline. Do not disturb without proper training and equipment. Neither of those does Noctis even have? <laughs> Please call Exinerus in case of emergency. Well, the woman who does this, her day, it's her day off today, so... You know, they've asked a random passerby to go and fiddle with the valves.